Cover Colorado first at five. It's been three years since the Cameron Peak fire. Colorado's largest fire ever torched more than 208,000 acres in Larimer County. Yeah, while well, many homes were lost, so too was the ecosystem around critical watersheds for northern Coloradans. Your northern newsroom reporter, Dylan Thomas, has followed the restoration process for years now for you and has learned that beavers could play a major role in the recovery. Saturday afternoon, Northern Colorado will come together to celebrate the Poudre River, a lifeline through Northern Colorado at Poudre River Fest. That event actually helps raise money to protect the river. And there you'll also be able to learn about how local organizations are actually learning from beavers on how we can better rehabilitate the river. We are seeing some recovery uh, in the burn area, but there's still a lot of work to be done. Which is why those with the coalition for the Poudre River watershed are taking it upon themselves to do something about it. The Poudre River provides drinking water for over 300,000 people. And so this is definitely a real, real world impact that we're still seeing three years later. A rainy June resulted in sediment and debris once again plaguing the river to the point both Fort Collins and Greeley have had impacts to drinking water. This year they've had to shut off their intake structures at least for the past week. So how can we create natural filters for the water? How about low tech process based restoration? What's that? Well, in summary, man-made beaver dams. It's low tech because it's all done by hand. So we only use material on site and so and it's low cost and it's really impactful. They allow the water to pass but stop the sediment. So it provides this perfect opportunity to help the system recover after a severe wildfire. The team has already caught thousands of pounds of sediment with the ones they've built. I would say this project has been extremely effective at capturing sediment. It's looking really great. The willows are coming back. Um, it's functioning just as we intended. And so it's really exciting to see that we've um, effectively restored this beaver meadow. And as the years pass, it's only going to become um, more beneficial to the system. By building these dams, the belief is that the river will be stronger and cleaner and eventually the region will heal and maybe even beavers will move back and continue this work for us. If you're going to be at Poudre River Fest, make sure to swing by and say hi. I'll be there as well. In Northern Colorado, Dylan Thomas covering Colorado first. Well, it looks like it's going to be a fantastic event. Poudre River Fest is this Saturday from noon until 6 outside New Belgium Brewery in Fort Collins. We've got a schedule of all the awesome events on our website for you, and we'll be right back.